when you think about what makes a university great, it's really not a homogenous community. It's a diverse community that makes us um, so, so, so significantly stronger. From the standpoint of women, um, we're certainly seeing not necessarily a huge increase in the number of women applying, but where the increase is coming is ultimately in the high quality women that are applying. We're seeing greater numbers of those students. And so as a result, we're able to admit more women, which is translating it into ultimately enrolling more women. The yield has gone up for women as well. Uh, and so they're certainly seeing Carnegie Mellon perhaps differently than maybe some of their predecessors, recognizing that this is a community that does care an awful lot about underrepresented populations. And particularly in our STEM disciplines, women had been underrepresented. And even in the Tepper School, um, we have seen significant growth in terms of the yield in women uh, and so it's really you know from my standpoint terrific having been here for so long at Carnegie Mellon recognizing the huge gains that we've been making in this area in such a short amount of time. I've got to say you know we're pretty proud of the advances that we're making and I think that it makes a difference in the university community. I can't tell you how many faculty have reiterated the, how important it is um, to have women you know, represented in a way where the strengths of those students come out. Uh, and so um, I think the critical mass um, uh, issue is behind us and we have, I think, a great group of women that are joining the community this year. One of the things that I love about being an undergraduate admission is, you know, really, we're opportunity brokers, really. We're really, you know, providing opportunities for students that may never have thought about, you know, a, a kind of an experience like this. And so there's no better time to be an undergraduate admission, quite frankly, and, and I think in no better place than at Carnegie Mellon.